Hey guys, and welcome to Factions, I guess. Yes, welcome to Factions. And today, I, I thought, you know, normally we do, like, you know, block by block, we take it one step at a time. But I was looking around and some areas aren't appropriate, and I feel like just taking a random square, it kind of mixes things up, doesn't it? So what we are going to do is well by the title you can probably guess this is build an ocean and the way we're going to do this actually i'm pretty happy with the technique um i could have done some like weird sort of grid thing to have it like i can't wait till we get to like what to have like you know um it like be source blocks all the way down but i feel like that's way too much effort for something that's not that much of a big deal. To be fair, it would be good if I could do a grid thing for like the top layer and get like two source blocks just so people don't like destroy the water like really quickly. But mm, I, I don't think it's big enough of a deal that I should care. Not really, a, like, I don't even know why I'm removing the grass. We we're about to place tons of water. But you know, I, I thought you know that's something to do while we're talking. Now we're not going to get this done all the way done, and I'm hoping for the ocean to kind of have a shoreline just coming up here, cutting along here, coming back down here, coming back up uh, at the end of this bit. I'm not sure. Maybe that's too big, but I, I want a big ocean because I want to do a few islands and actually that reminds me we, we need to map out an island now I'm not sure if I'm a hundred percent set on having an island I feel like like of course I want an island but do I want like a big patch of ocean or do I want an island at first let's let's see um let, let's just map something out real quick something like um, no, we're gonna have it kind of weird. Uh, oh, we're, we're being quite diagonal, I don't like that. And then we're, we're going to have it very, like, straight. Not straight, but, like, thin. Like, really thin, but long. Like my penis. What the fuck is wrong with me? Not, can't have a normal video, can we? Can we? No, we cannot. And something about, uh, like that. Hmm, maybe if we do something like, bring this out. You'll see what I'm doing in a second. And then we'll, what we'll do is we'll remove this, this, this to remove all of this bit um, bring it in about here okay, I know there's just like a mumble of blocks here but ah, you know what, that, that's kind of like an island you know, that, that's pretty random so what we're going to have to do is fill this in which, I, you know what, we'll, we'll, we'll just do that on camera so the idea is I want to have it seem like a normal Minecraft world. I want to split up the biomes and I want an opportunity to have completely different biomes. So that's the reason I'm putting in an ocean because once you pick your first biome, you gotta kinda go through a path. You gotta do the quick transition, desert to savannah, savannah to custom savannah, custom savannah to like custom mesa, custom mesa to mesa, mesa to mesa to desert, desert to jungle, jungle to any other trees. You know what I mean? You have to do that sand to jungle, that sort of desert to jungle thing to get, you know, back to trees or back to like a cold environment. And even if you do want to do a cold environment, first of all, you got to put some birch in beforehand to do the transition you know and I'm not complaining like yeah I got a good system going but it's like ah, I 
kind of like to just sit and like, you know, build some like freaky ass biome, you know, like maybe like a dead tree biome. Oh, that's good. Put pods all on the ground, have dead trees and like the occasional brown mushroom. Oh, that that's the that's the next biome. So that that's what we're going to try to do. Also, it, it gives me an opportunity to put in islands. Islands are always good for tactics. You know, factions. You know, it, it is about factions. You know, islands they make great factions. So you know, I I want a few islands about forty to fifty blocks away from each other. So maybe about three islands per grid, I guess. Um, not this obviously because just starting so it kind of takes away that opportunity maybe not three islands, islands per grid that, that's a bit that kind of pushing it about one and a half islands per grid and I say half because you know we'll, we'll be building between grids you know I, I've kind of been sticking to that biome per grid or you know keep your biomes like in a grid because the grid helps you like thingy things so you don't like you know take things too far but I feel like you know it's kind of it's kind of getting annoying, so I I want to you know so over here this is looking nice this is looking nice so now all we gotta do is grab some sand uh, we go round it with sand and I want to get to the the actual placing of the water I'll I'll do a uh, time lapse of that probably. So we're, we're going to get the sand, right? And keep in mind, the water is going to be on this level, right? And then what we'll do, we'll place all the water. Oh, I'll explain it while we do this. I'll place all the water, right? And then I'll start digging down after I place all the water. So then, basically, the water flows down and it looks like an ocean. I'm not going to have, like, one block high water, you know? I kind of be silly. You know, but yeah, and I might have it like up to 30 blocks. I'm not going any deeper than 30 blocks. Any deeper than 30 blocks, I'm kind of getting to a point where I'm just like, okay, well, that's kind of ridiculous, isn't it, Robbie? You know, and the sand that goes here because, the, yeah, so like the sand's going to the beach part. Um, I'm going to swap this part out for uh, grass, I, I'd say. Yeah, let's, let's swap this part out for grass. And not all of it, so this bit, this isn't going to be connected to the water. Uh, actually, no, let's do this whole bit. This isn't going to be connected to the water. This bit, a little bit higher up. And then back to the sand. And then, yeah, more sand. So, you know, it's, it's mainly beachy around the side, but, you know, not all beachy. And then we just fill it in with the grass. And I'm not, you know what, we won't work on the island yet. We're, we're going to place it just so we got a good idea, see how it looks. Maybe plant the log, no, we're not going to plant the log. Um, yeah, just, just so we kind of got a decent idea of, you know, what we're working with. Because, you know, I don't want to, you know, put down notion and then finally work on this and be like, oh no, I don't like that. You know what I mean? Because the ocean, it would be, actually, it wouldn't be that hard to clean up since we would have like working sponges. But you know, still, it, it, it's a hassle that I'd rather not be given with. So let's get this done. I'm actually refinding my love for factions. If you look at my channel, like at my videos on my channel, I kind of lose my passion for factions, like you can see it, like there's one video where I'm like alright well let's put this down and that down and this and I don't really work on much, it, it's kind of like a half ass video, but with factions it's like, with like factions now, it's like okay well now I'm inspired because like that's what I mean, I, I, I was getting an absolute headache working over at the Mesa sort of thing. You know, it, it would just, it would do my head in. No, I'm actually going to have this come up. I have this. I, I know I said I wasn't really going to work on the island, but I feel like working on the, like, structure of the island, that, that's okay. 
and all that, because that's normally the stuff I do for the grid off camera. But since it's an island, you know, I can do it on camera. And if you see how long this is actually taking, think how fucking long it takes on the on the grids. Let let you be real, like fucking headache. It's an absolute headache. I've spent like the last two hours filling in some of that, filling in that, gridding it out, uh, filling in some of the other bit. And, you know, granted, I will listen to a podcast, so I'm not exactly complaining. You know, it's time to listen to a podcast, my internet was down, so you know. She recorded this, I didn't even think, like, I thought of it like I was live streaming, but I, I didn't even bother. But yeah, she should record it. But you know, no big deal. And it gave me time to finish off my podcast. It, it, it's okay. Um. So yeah. So I just heard. I'm sorry. So this is almost done, and then we can start working on the fun part. By the fun part, I mean placing all the water, which doesn't sound fun. But you guys don't need to like listen. I'll be playing music, and I'll I'll be time lapsing it because that's fun. You know, sometimes I'll be like mid-recording, right? Because I never r really record something methodical like this. But you know, it, it gives me time to just ramble on, you know? Um... Hmm, the island is looking pretty small. Hmm... We're going to bring this out a bit. See, th this is the thing, you know? You gotta just, like... People don't think Robbie's a good builder. Robbie's a great builder. The only thing is, you know, I, um, I just don't like, um, building, uh, like, building. You know, I don't really build buildings. I don't, I'm not good at it. Like, I, I watch B double O, I watch Good Time with Scar, I watch a uh, Green, I watch, like, I watch good builders on YouTube. I just, I, I take all the tips, but I, I just, can't do it and we're probably going to do a little sandbank over here about that oh and see see that that's a good technique especially if you want something to look natural if you pull away while you're doing it or push forward while you're doing it it, it really gives a sort of like natural sort of like gradient where it like fades into a biome and it's like you can you totally control the gradient you know, and then like you go, you look at it, you're like, okay, well that doesn't look right. Let's we'll bring that in, bring that in, uh, chop off that, and that there. You know, and then you're like, boom. So I think that looks nice. I don't know a hundred percent what we're going to be doing with it, but n <laughs> now it's time for the time lapse. Do 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 do. I think I'm just going to be talking to you guys, I don't have any decent, like, non-copyright music to play, and I feel like that would bore you guys anyway, so yeah, I'll just talk over it, probably I'll do pish uh, later on, and yeah, let me get started. Hey guys, so, you know, I'm feeling in the ocean, and it, it doesn't take as long as I thought it would, but what I want to say is my next biome is going to be good, I'm, I'm either thinking cliffs, or like, moshy sort of swamp lands but like Scottish style so I'm gonna put some wheat there some like reeds and sorry sugar cane you know and it, it's gonna look really nice and that that's all I really wanted to say it's a quick clip kind of barely mention it at the end I just want to keep you updated on you know what, I, what I'm planning what I'm planning you know because the plans are good anyway I guess back to Past me, which I always say, which is weird. Do 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 past me, do do. Wow, that um, that took much, 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 much less time than I thought it would. I legit just had to go around the rough bits and like one line there. I don't even think I need to do that part. But you know, and then it just did itself. Oh no, I actually love Minecraft. This is what I love about this game. So now, 
No, I'll I'll show you what we have to do now. Um, it, it's it's really fucking annoying. So I mean, just just to clarify, it's so fucking annoying that I even have to do this. And I can't even find gravel. Where the fuck is gravel? Sorry, these are normally PG, aren't they? Um, uh, uh, crap. Um, where the there it is. There you are, gravel. Oh shit. Oh no, there's a cave here. Oh no. No, because I, I didn't realize how much of a hell my life is going to be placing gravel. So I'm legit going to have to go with that. No, let's just there. Too. Now, this isn't. We're only going to have to do this for the bits that um, like we're we're going to do this at the end. But I'm just putting it around the coast because the coast is basically done. Like you know. You know, the coast is like, you know, it, it may as well be done. It is not done because, you know, no, it is actually done. Once, once I put in the gravel, the coast is done. And then we just go deeper and deeper and deeper. And then at one point we drop by like three, four, five, you know what I mean. So I want it to be like really deep by the time you get to there. So I feel like this end will come in shallower. And the bit that isn't the thing will like go in like so much deeper, like the bit by the island. The other part, I'm just gonna have it kind of medium, like the bit far off over there. You know, and like to be fair, the deepness is not a massive deal. It just, you know, as long as it's like over 15 blocks. On like m some areas, if we're good, you know. But I plan to go like way over like, twenty blocks. But I think I'm going to have to be going do 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 like removing it all manually. So you know, it's going to be pretty hectic. And then after that, I gotta remove the bottom layer. Or no, I won't remove the bottom layer. I'll just place this on top. Just this bit, I have to remove the bottom layer because oh fuck it, there's some gravel. I don't know, that looks like that'll change it. Why did I get stuck? So, yes. I'm, I'm really enjoying factions at the moment. And there, there's a really nice area along, like, just along. And I feel like that would be amazing to have a meteor fall in it. So I think we're going to do a meteor. You know, it, it, first of all, it's entertaining. And it looks really nice. And like, you know, it, it, first of all, it's going to be fun to make. Like, let's be real. Like, it's going to be so fun to make a fucking meteor. And if you have any suggestions on what the meteor should be made out of, please leave it in the comments. Thank you. So, that, that should challenge for today. Tell, tell me what you think of the meteor. Um, I, I'm not sure if you'll still be watching. Oh wait, no, 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 no because I, I would have sped up like the water by like four times or eight times, depending on how long it is, you know. And then you know, then you can tell me about what you think of the meteor. How much further do we have to go? Oh, we're almost to there. There we go. Now, you know, that that is looking pretty good. I, I, I'm actually happy with that. Now, keep in mind, this is going to dip off. You know, this bit going to go really deep. And, you know, this bit, you know, going to be basically like a trench around here. You know, it's going to be maybe like five, six blocks deep going along here. Thank God I did this clip. Because that actually means I can drop it off quicker. You know, five, six blocks deep. You know, here it's going to go slower and slower, but this is going to be deeper than, 
you know, this, I guess. Yeah, it will be. You know. Oh, no, like, actually looking at the ocean right now. It's looking nice. It's looking really nice at the moment. You know, I'm going to put the sand up in the off camera. And, oh yeah. Oh, do we want to do this like, oh, that'd be nice. Like, turn this into a natural beach. Yeah, and that works with the biome as well, you know, because this, this can easily change into, yeah, I know I planned a dark oak. So dark oak, dark oak, dark oak. Uh, like tropical but not jungle like small jungle trees oh that's going to be so nice mm. yeah I think that's what we're going to do so I'm going to get right back with you guys once I've filled this in and I'm going to draw a few things around it you know make it look nice and then I'll get back with you guys okay guys so basically what I've done is I've kind of you know, but first of all, this sand took forever to fill in, and like the decoration took minutes, minutes. You know, I put some logs. Uh, I'm thinking of this as like clumps of sand, or you know, um, the kind of remind well, like if you go sea fishing, you'll know what rig worms are. They're like the worms that you get under the sand. Kind of reminds me of that. It kind of the same sort of color. Um, it's not supposed to be rig worms, it's just supposed to be like something on there. You know, we got some shrubbery, dead bushes. Um, to be fair, I was just sitting thinking and I've been inspired to do a lot of um, things based on like Scottish environment, which might sound fucking ridiculous, especially if you're Scottish, because you'll be like, wait, what are you talking about? But I'm thinking of over here, right, cause we're probably going to end the ocean about here. No, that's way too low. About over here, just at the front end of this, right? So then we got a decent bit, right? And I'll go over there as well. I'm thinking of having like a few sort of things based on like Scottish environment. And I think it's going to look really nice. Um, a few ideas, you know, I'm thinking of maybe putting cliffs over there. It's gonna be nice, okay? It's gonna be nice. And it's gonna be, up. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of stuff. And this has opened up so much. So, um, yeah guys, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, remember what I told you to comment. I, I kind of forgot what I told you to comment. But I'm sure it's important. You know, um, so, you know. Comment what I told you to, and I'll see you guys. Oh, yeah, like, subscribe. Um, my merch is in the description. There's t shirt for £45. I know it's expensive, I only get 14%. I'm not trying to scam you. And there are badges for £4 something, which you know, so about $50 and £5, uh, and $5, roundabout, maybe more, maybe less. So, yeah, if you want to support me by that, then. Go ahead and buy that, I guess. And I'll see you guys uh, later.